You, your dog is coughing? Why you should never use this over-the-counter cough syrup? Use this new, safer, more effective natural option. Hello, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, welcome. Click there to subscribe. Hit the bell to sign up for notifications. Then when you click the link directly in the box below, I can send you a copy of my free book. Your dog's coughing. I mean, that's something I heard pretty commonly in veterinary practice. I mean, your dog could be coughing for an array of different reasons, be it tracheal collapse, be it kennel cough. And you would not believe how many times I said, don't worry, just go to the pharmacy, pick yourself up some of this stuff. This over-the-counter cough syrup, just make sure it has dextromethorphan. You know, the crazy thing is this is still happening, ongoing. I'm sure there's been like billions of doses of this stuff given to our dogs or cats. But there's a couple of big, big problems here. Number one, you know, this liquid dextromethorphan and cough syrup crap. I'm sure you've all had umpteen doses as a kid. It is not really that effective. It tastes horrible. There are an array of potential side effects in our dogs. Vomiting and diarrhea, sleepiness, drooling, anxiousness. More serious side effects include rapid heartbeat, incoordination, muscle tremors, collapse, seizures. The most studied natural remedy for coughing in our dogs, our cats, is none other than. This is a great natural anti-cough remedy which has been extensively studied. It includes honey, it includes a lemon juice. You know, you've got the honey being antibacterial, you have the honey being antiviral. And then topically, it will naturally soothe that inflamed throat. It's kind of exactly what we want without any side effects. Then the lemon juice, this provides a high, high level of vitamin C. So it's this wonderful antioxidant, which also has specific antiviral properties. It's like, hmm, ever think of maybe naturally treating kennel cough? It gets some of the vitamin C that's specifically in this lemon juice. This is the remedy I'd use for our 20 pound little Tula. So we're starting with one cup of hot water. This is our local natural honey. We have one tablespoon of that. We're gonna dissolve in our hot water. Mm, honey. Next, our concentrated pure lemon juice. Of that, we're gonna be using one teaspoon. Here is our honey and lemon concoction. And this is the amount that I give to little Tula throughout the day. So I'd be giving her sort of three to four tablespoons at a shot. Let's see if you'll drink this on your own. So good for you. You want some? Honey lemon. Mmm. Mmm. Oh. <laughs> I think the lemon sometimes has a little bit of a tang to it. Plan B, we're going with a syringe. And that's, what is this, a 10 cc syringe? You know, this is like, if it was a full cup, it's 240 mils, so I'd need many of those. 24 syringes, so it's okay to have a bigger syringe. Let's just try it with a syringe and see if this works. Come here, good girl. Mmm. That's the other option, get yourself a bigger size syringe and then dose that in, splitting that up into four equal servings. You're gonna be treating your dog somewhere between five to 10 days and or you know, as needed if you're treating, dealing with something like tracheal collapse, which is an ongoing cough, which you seem to have, little poodle. Thanks so much for watching this edition of Veterinary Secrets of why you shouldn't be using over-the-counter cough syrup for coughing and a way better, safer, and more effective natural option. Click up there to subscribe. Hit the bell to sign up for notifications and then when you click the link directly in the box below, I can send you a copy of my free book.